Hi, this is Mark from Wiki Design. In this Elementor tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can easily reverse your column layouts on mobile devices. So before we jump into it, let me show you exactly what we're going to be doing and why you may need to do this. So in this example, you can see that this is a simple two column layout, some text on the left and an image. Now, when you scale down and you start to get to mobile devices, it stacks the way you thought, the way you think it should, which is <clears throat> text on the top, image on the bottom. That's great, but in some cases you may want to flip it where you can have the image on the top of the text just on mobile devices. So the great thing about Elementor is that this is all built into their system and no longer do you have to, um, you know, hack your CSS code to make this happen. This used to be a much more difficult process um, before this uh, was released in Elementor. And if you have Elementor Pro, I'm going to show you um, a good example in a header. If you have like a three column layout, how using this technique can speed up the process uh, on your mobile layouts as well. So let's just jump right into it. Uh, let me close this down, jump right into Elementor. And like I said, this is great because this is a very easy thing to do. So the way that this works is you can reverse uh, columns uh, on whole sections. So when you click up here, you see that this is your whole section, which is just these two columns uh, like this. So let's go into mobile layout. And as you can see, it's doing exactly what it should be doing, which is just having the text here and the image on the bottom. But um, to change the layout on mobile only, just go into your section. As you can see right here, edit section, go to advanced, responsive, and it's as easy as clicking that button right there. So as you can see, now the image is on the top and the text is on the bottom. Now, depending on your layout and what you have in there, you may have to go in and start to um, play around with padding um, because the layout has now switched. So you might have cases where your header might bump up right underneath your image or whatever it may be. So you might have to play around with some additional um, padding and margins and stuff like that uh, to make it look good. But yeah, again, it's as easy as just going into responsive and um, on your section and hitting uh, reverse columns. And they give you the option to do this on tablet as well. So that's a good feature. Now, if you have pro, um, this is a, this is, we use this a lot in our header section. So here's a good example where, um, let me jump into the header template right here. So uh, discard that. So we recently did this where um, you have a three column layout and by default, it's going to just stack navigation, the logo, then the icons. Let's say you wanted to flip this where you wanted the icons on the top and that's as easy as same process. You just go in here and click mobile. So now you can have your uh, icons on the top menu on the right. So this, this works really well in headers, uh, especially for three column layouts. If you want to do all of this without having to uh, do any additional CSS work. So in this case, you may want to have it where these icons are centered just on mobile. Um, so yeah, this is a great example of how easy it is to start to manipulate how uh, columns are laid out on mobile devices. And um, yeah, it's all just right built into Elementor. Um, hope this hel uh, video was helpful. Thank you for watching this Elementor tutorial. If you'd like to receive future videos like this, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the notification bell. Thank you and have a great day.